Hi guys, welcome to the Entrepreneur Show mini episode. Today is April the... Not April, just joking. Today is March the 31st. And um, two days ago, I made a video called uh, A Message to All the Republicans Slash Conservative Who is Always Distant on Barack Obama. And I got like 37 comments in less than two days. And I thought it was, it was good all, overall. You know, people are arguing. Some people supporting me, some people are against me. And it was a good argument, you know. I want, a lot of people made some good points. So, um, some people, I think, convinced other people to choose different sides. But it was a it was a good argument overall. But at the same time, I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I offended uh, any Republicans or anybody who watched the video who got upset. I'm sorry if I offended you guys. I just try to say my opinion, and um, I'm just sorry. But after reading a comment that one of my subscribers said, um, he kind of convinced me to. Um, kind of changed my attitude in this whole economy crisis situation. Uh, what I'm trying to say is that uh, I think we got we guys got to stop pointing fingers at each other, blaming the Bush administration or Barack Obama administration or the Clinton administration, and we just got to you know, stop pointing fingers and just unite together, be brothers and sisters, and try to fix the economy because that's what's most important. Uh, call me stupid, but I think all of us want the same thing. We all want the economy to be better so we can be happy and splurge our money on ridiculous things. But um, it's not just one person's fault. It's, um, it's everyone's, everyone's at fault here. AIG's at fault. The, bad, the banks giving out bad mortgages and toxic assets. Also, the people are taking the loans knowing that they would not be able to afford this. Um, the Bush administration, Barack Obama administration, the Clinton administration, if you guys are saying it's true. But I think everyone's at fault here, and instead of bickering, we should unite together and try to solve this economy crisis because if we keep pointing fingers, um, the economy could crumble. So um, my question for you guys is, if you were Barack Obama, what would you do to fix the economy? Um, obviously, there's, not, there's many solutions to solve the economy crisis. And that's the problem. Everyone has their different. Everyone has a, a different solution to solve the problem. So, what is your solution to solve the economy crisis? And uh, please write your comments. And next week, I'll, not next week, but in two days, maybe Friday or Thursday, I will answer my own question. But I just want to see what do you guys, what would you do if you're Barack Obama? How would you solve this economic crisis? Oh yeah, and um, I just saw this v video just two seconds ago. Michelle Bachman, you crazy. You just crazy right there. And uh thank you for watching the mini episode and I'll see you Thursday, Friday, someday. I think Friday. Actually no, I'll put Thursday. But today's Tuesday, yeah. I'll, I'll see you guys Thursday. Peace. And don't forget to write your comment, rate this video, and subscribe. Thanks.